Hello YouTube and YouTube Pike Community, this is Briar Blade and we're going to do our first light in our Vermont Freehand Rhodesian uh, smooth briar pipe, beautiful pipe. Uh, nice thing when you buy a pipe from smokingpipes.com is the pipe you see is the pipe you get. And this one here, the whole top is all bird's eye, a lot of bird's eye here in the shank and a lot of straight green uh, it's just super nice pipe uh, real light uh, it's uh I say it's not a super small but it's not you know it's kind of like a, a little bit smaller than medium sized pipe but uh, this smokes as good as my Morta from them uh, should smoke fantastic because my mortar poker from them really smokes nice and we're smoking in it for the first time some bourbon blue uh, really like this tobacco I have several cans in the cellar in fact I got an order of tobacco in today and I think I ordered another four cans of this put in the cellar uh, it has a light topping of some bourbon in it but not too much to make it goopy in that but uh, really good stuff if you haven't had a chance to try it I recommend it so here we go and I do have my flamethrowers so I'm going to be a little careful here going to dedicate this pipe to Virginia's is what I'm going to end up doing. My A good draw. I wouldn't say it's uh, you know overly big draw on it compared for English, but uh, you probably could smoke either one. But I want to dedicate this to Virginia's. But uh, I really, really like this. Uh, Bourbon blue. It's really good stuff. Like I said earlier, if you haven't had a chance to try it, I recommend it because it is very tasty tobacco and uh, very plentiful. You don't have no problem getting it either, it seems like. So, but, uh, eh. My uh, Paul Winslow pipe that I got, a uh, Winslow pipe. I'm going to dedicate that to English when I do my first light on that, which I'll be doing soon. And uh, we had, like, say, thunderstorms that rolled through to last night. Did get no rain. Really windy here today. I mean, 35, 40 mile an hour winds, probably gust of 35, 40 miles an hour. Uh, Maybe spring's here finally. <laughs> uh, not counting on it, but I think so. At least I hope so. And I uh, want to say thanks to all the new and old subscribers. Really appreciate them all. Uh, got a couple of pipes done. I got, I'm going to be taking pictures of the one pipe that I uh, showed on Instagram that I was working on. I got one done, and all I got left on the other one. Uh, is to make another stem for that one yet and uh, then I got two more I'm going to start on I'm going to make them kind of oh I don't know mix them up maybe make a 
uh, acorn or maybe a squat tomato or something kind of like it. But I uh, haven't really decided yet. Still got the briar yet, so uh, we'll see. Takes me a little bit longer than some because I do pretty much everything with Dremel and a drill. And uh, I uh, used to have a lathe way back, but after the tornado came through, and that was something I didn't buy back because I didn't do a lot of metal and, and uh, woodworking anymore. I did buy my, you know, a lot of my other stuff, my tools, and oh, drill press, and a little sandblaster, but due to the fact I can't get around very good at all, I don't can't walk, uh, I'm in a wheelchair, like I said before, and, but I, you know, I like goofing around, because it makes my day go fast, and, and I enjoy doing it, it's something I've done for a long time, I, uh, so, but, uh, thanks for everybody there watching, and, uh, we'll catch y'all till next time, Bear Blades and Sweet Smokes, and, uh, bye-bye.